Hey guys, Zen here, and we've been steady creating some really unique what if Pokemon scenarios with popular games, animes, and even cartoon shows. But today, we're going even deeper and turning random emoji into Pokemon. And with the help of the amazing artist, the Ponyo, we have just that with seven brand new amazing Pokemon, completely based off of a few little emojis. And if you like this kind of video, or want to be a part of a future emoji video, well then, drop three of your favorite emojis in the comments down below for a chance to get featured. With that, let's get started with our first combo. We've got a boar, a ghost, and an angry face. Put it all together and what do you get? Well, you get Gore, the ghost fire type Pokemon. The concept obviously captures the boar idea, which is already kind of associated with anger, since most boars are known to be a little hot-headed. But if that wasn't enough, its typing can round it all together with the ghost fire type. Now, I personally really love the ethereal hair flowing back, which helps capture even more of a ghostly presence. But this Pokemon's hidden ability, Anger Point, is just too good to round out this emoji mon. Hey, I guess that's what we're gonna call them. It's said that Gore have a fiery temper and are often found in stampedes, igniting fires in their path. Known for its formidable anger, it can explode into a fiery rampage when provoked, destroying literally everything in their path. Let me tell you right now, Annihilate is definitely scared of this Pokemon. But what do you guys think? Now it's time for our next Emojimon, based on these three emojis. We've got a Hippo, a Snowflake, and an Ocean Wave. What could it possibly be? Well. How about a regional variant? Meet Emojian Hippowdon, the water ice type Pokemon. A concept which fits the Sinoian variant so well, taking the already hot desert hippo and turning it into a much cooler version now fully adapted to icy aquatic environments. Its stats are pretty similar to it with its less than stellar speed, but its abilities help this Pokemon make up for it. Just throw a snowstorm and this hippo is zooming. It's said that this Hippowdon are also known to roam the icy shores and frozen rivers of their respective regions. They can use their massive jaws to break icebergs for food or to reform giant glaciers. Definitely a concept that I can see existing in the world of Pokemon, that's for sure. But what do you guys think? Now let's check out this emoji trio. We've got a lizard, a lightning bolt, and a tornado. Oh wow, this is a really nice emoji concept right here. And the final result is way better than you guys could have expected. Meet Comolisk, the electric flying type Pokemon, an evolution to Heliolisk. Now this Pokemon melds the agility and sleekness of a lizard with the dynamic nature of storms, making it a swift and shocking concept for this Emojimon series. And making it an evolution for an often forgotten about Pokemon is always a plus here on the channel. Omolisk can generate powerful storms by flapping their arms together, which kind of act like wings when needed, channeling the energy of lightning and tornadoes. This Pokemon is often seen darting through severe storms, almost like a lightning bolt itself. And well, how do you even evolve into this Pokemon? Well, how about if we make it as simple as learning the move Rain Dance? All in favor? Okay, perfect. And that's Komolisk, everybody. Now let's create some magic with these emojis. A shrimp, a microphone, and a musical note. What on earth could this combo create? Introducing Tenostar, the steel fairy type Pokemon, a typing that I have been a fan of since Gen 9's Tinkaton. Now this concept takes the characteristics of a shrimp and almost gives it a little mermaid treatment, turning it into a giant singing Sebastian, if you will. I always thought sound-based Pokemon are so unique and love that it can continually be explored to create new Pokemon such as Tenostar, which is why I can definitely view it as a design that's closest to the real deal. Like you guys can't tell me that this shrimp doesn't look like something Game Freak would create themselves. Right? Anyway, as for its dex entry, it's said that its steel hard body can produce enchanting melodies that resonate through the metal, captivating all those who hear it. It's both a performer and a protector, with its shields and sonic blasts. Definitely a Pokemon I would love to have on my team, that's for sure. Now let's get a bit creepy with these emojis next. 
a spider, theatrical masks, and some hearts. Put it all together and we get something like Dramarack, the bug poison type Pokemon. The name is a mix of drama, hence the masks and arachnoids for the spider. Its many legs have different expressions to depict the comedy and tragedy of this Pokemon. And the heart brings it all together to combine the elements of dramatic and emotional expression. Almost like it's weaving a tail together. Get it? Because it's a spider and weaving it. Any, anyway, Dramarack are known to weave intricate patterns to intimidate predators and rivals alike. And their webs are both beautiful feats as well as deadly to the touch, since they are in fact poisonous, laced with enough potent neurotoxins to take down a fully grown Dragonite. Don't let this Pokemon's many faces fool you, or else. Move over area though, so there's a new King Arachnid in town. Now let's check out another really cool concept with these emojis. First we've got the smirky devil face, a purple heart, and a deer. Put it all together and you might have yourself a new mythical Pokemon. Meet Alistag, the ghost dark type Pokemon. Now this concept brings together the deer with its antlers as well as the whole purple heart and devilish look. How you ask? Well look at that sinister smirk. But that's not all. This Pokemon also has two brand new and unique signature abilities. First is Shadow Shield, which lets this Pokemon take less damage when their HP is full, similar to Marble Scale. Then for its hidden ability, we have Heartbreak, oh no, which lowers the opponent's attack stat sharply when this Pokemon faints, making it a pretty unique and strong competitive Pokemon. It's also said that Alistag can travel through shadows with the aid of their beautiful and eerie antlers, which have their own unique properties. It's also said to feed on the fear of those lost in its woods, which give me huge Dark Rye vibes, which is why I think this Pokemon would make for a terrific mythical Pokemon, don't you guys think? Alright, now it's time to tackle these two emojis. First, we've got a whale and a rocket. And although it's only two emojis, don't you think even for a second that this next Pokemon isn't going to be out of this world? <laughs> no, seriously. Me Ultra Beast Whistle, the Psychic Steel type Pokemon. A Pokemon whose shiny I am in love with. It gives me huge anti Eternatus vibes, but that could just be me. It's said that this Pokemon can traverse the cosmos using psychic abilities to help it navigate and manipulate gravitational forces, often leading to the creation of new solar systems or the annihilation of entire galaxies. Oh boy, that's definitely one powerful Pokemon, but I'm sure there's some 10 year old new Pokemon trainer out there that can catch it. And like, what could possibly go wrong with that? All right, all right, now let's talk about the Emojimon. I loved each and every single one of these brand new Emojimons. There are definitely a few that stuck out for me, Alistag being one of them, with its dope design and aura which makes it feel like a real Pokemon. Then we've got Tenastar, the singing shrimp that could also blast you into a whole new time zone. This one is growing on me for many reasons. First is its amazing typing being Fairy Steel, as well as it being a combination of a sound based Pokemon design which I love love when Game Freak does it so you already know I would love it here as well. And lastly, the Ultra Beast Whistle. It is such a neat design and idea that you can probably create an entire region or story behind it. Maybe something like that Ultra Beast created an entire world with only Emojimon. Would be an interesting idea, but what do you guys think? Anyway, be sure to drop your favorite emojis in the comments to be a part of a future video and check out one of these videos here next. Trust me, you won't be disappointed.